story up in the news today is we're talking Skyrim. It, it oh, had God. a huge first day. Can you buy me a copy of Skyrim? That'd be awesome, thanks. Maybe someone in the chat. Um, so <laughs> <laughs> We're going to start a Kickstarter for uh, Flitz getting Skyrim. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, Bethesda reported that they're expecting Skyrim to have made $450 million at launch. Wow. That is a lot wow. of money for that a lot of fun. dragons that I'm going to be fighting when I get home tonight. You're Asian, do the math. How many copies is that? Wow. Ten. Ten. Ten copies. <laughs> Man, that's a fucking game. Bad with calculator. <laughs> but I really just chose this news story just to have an excuse to talk about Skyrim because I just, <laughs> I, I'm amazed by this game. Like, just the combat itself, because we're talking martial arts tonight. You can fight fists, you can have a sword and magic, two swords, <laughs> a staff, any combination you Broomstick. want. Broomstick. Broomstick. Not staff. Broomstick. <laughs> it's a go along with their cupcake and beer. <laughs> <laughs> so um, it, this is actually uh, the, the first time I'm jumping into an, uh, not Oblivion, but an uh, Elder Scrolls game. I was kind of iffy because I didn't enjoy Fallout 3 as much as I thought I would. It was just a little too open world. I like more of a stronger story. But um, I built my character pretty quickly, and then just a few minutes into this game, Can I was like <laughs> breathtaking. Like, you start off with a dragon attacking your city, and you gotta get the fuck out of there. And at that moment, I knew that's why this game's number one right now. So I've been playing Saints Row. That's uh, not, that's not terrible. terrible. There's no dragons. <laughs> There, no, stuff. there's just other gangs. What's up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, purple deltas! Yay! <laughs> Awkward. <laughs>